We are, we are here at the famous Old Dupai Gorge, where remains of the ancient humans, prehumans, and extinct animals were excavated by the Likis and other scientists. Old Dupai Gorge is famous for the discoveries of the ancient uh, prehuman species known as Australopithecus boisei or Zinjanthropus, Homo habilis, which is the first Homo genus, uh, Homo erectus, Homo sapien, and Homo sapiens sapien. Also, at Old Dupai, remains of the extinct animals of different kinds were found, as well as different kinds of stone tools. But the proper name of the gorge is Old Dupai and not Old Dupai. Old Dupai originated from this plant, which is a wild sisal plant. So, the first scientist who made this place famous, Professor Wilhelm Katwinkel, uh, mispronounced the name of the gorge uh, and put V instead of P, and that made the name to be known worldwide as Old Dubai. But it is uh, correctly pronounced with the P, and that's Old Dubai. Uh, Old Dubai is a natural gorge which was exposed by water, and at one time uh, there was no gorge, uh, but instead the area was under water. There was an alkaline lake, about 20 by 15 kilometers lake. But later it dried because of the faultings of the Eastern African Rift. So after the lake dried, the gorge was formed by water erosion. And that have exposed a lot of ancient human remains, extinct animals uh, for us to study. And still today, a lot of discoveries has been made and that made this place to be one of the world famous archaeological sites. We have a museum here at the site and we have got also a new museum uh, structure which is to be done in the new uh, in the few weeks to come and uh, the new museum will attract as we hope different uh, tourists local and foreigners and this will also add a privilege for the local people to be more involved in the uh, tourist activities such as tour guiding, interpretation to visitors, uh, hiking safaris into the archaeological sites and uh, we do expect also that local people will help us to do proper interpretation of some of the local names and use, local use of the natural vegetation around this area which are very useful uh, to the local people as local medicine. And these working, interpretative walking trails will help the local people to have a job of escort, escorting visitors into these archaeological sites which are right on the floor of the gorge. But also we do have uh, the living museum uh, which is the old Leakey's uh, research camp. So on the way down, local people will have an opportunity to teach visitors about different uh, uh, vegetation that are so useful to them uh, as medicine and some are used as um, uh, vegetation that would allow local people to keep off evil from their families. So there will be a learning uh, journey from the top where the museum is all the way down into the archaeological site. Mepata saida sisi wenyewe hapa barba hapa. Mepata saida huyu professor yeye ambaye afikaga na Dr. Lick. Wametupa msaada wa shilingi 500 za Tanzania kujenga bomba linaloitwa Dani Ndondo Water Project. Ambalo limetokea mbali hapa huko milimani ambalo natumika sasa. Kwa hiyo nimepata faida ya wale watu kutengenezea bomba maji kutoka huko mwanzo hadi mwisho wa kijiji ambayo ilitumika hadi sasa. Kwa hiyo tumepata faida hiyo kupitia mambo ya kale. Kwa sababu kwanza umetumeomba kuomba tengeneza baraza la wafugaji ambayo ni kitengo kati ya ambayo ni kiungo kati ya mamlaka eh, sisi na, na, na mamlaka sisi wenyeji. Kimesomesha watoto wetu tunapata mafungu na mamilioni ya hela kuna vijana waliosoma mpaka vyo vikuu vyo vya kati na ma, masuala mbalimbali wamejengea mahala ya kuhifadhi chakula wamejengea vyakula kila wakati wamejengea sahani ya NCA hata shule zetu 
Kwa hiyo tunapata faida sisi kutoka kwa NCA. Na bado NCA bado tunatamwambia watupa ajira. Kwa hiyo tunapata matunda sisi cream. Wanagawa cream NCA kutoka si wenyeji hapa wa Ngorongoro. Ifanye nzima Ngorongoro. Licha ya maeneo ya barabara pekee na old pie. Serikali wametupa nafasi ya kutengeneza hizo boma za utamaduni na tuta tu, na, tu, kwa mfano hizo boma ambazo tumepewa ni ya kudumisha utamaduni ya kabila yetu kama kwa mfano pale wazungu wanaweza kuja kwenye hilo boma na ikijulikana kiserikali kama ni boma ambapo inafanya biashara kwa wamasai na ni boma ambapo inafanya kuingiza kuingiza budget ndani ya jamii ya wamasai baada ya wamasai wakija kuimba lugha yao na kwa hiyo 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 naye hiyo hizo boma za utamaduni naweza kusema ni faida naweza kusema ni faida kwa sababu msungu atatoka zipo nje ipo zinje ya ida, ya nani ya makumbusho hapo mzungu atakapoingia na sisi tunapata hiyo risala kwa hiyo hiyo naweza kusema faida moja hiyo hi um, my name is Valerie and this is my dad Pierre we are both from France in Lyon uh, it was a dream of us to come to a safari and when we were looking to select the destination uh, Tanzania was the best place to see the most variety of uh, uh, landscapes and animals. When researching where to go and which tour to do here in Tanzania we heard about Odelweiss Gorge and coming here without looking at where humanity were born was impossible. So we spent one day coming here to Old Uvai to discover where our species, our race um, started and was born. Coming here is a lovely walk. It's also a walk through history, which is thanks to the museum that explains the whole work that is being done. Uh, even today, people still work to find fossils and bones. I'm holding a leg bone of a giraffe. It's a real bone, it's not a fossil. Here the people work to maintain this site so everybody can come and discover our history. Thank you very much.